And of course, most people have dropped those by now. But um, in terms of in terms of one of the connections I've seen, it's all going in that direction. It's just the one of the largest sources of, of data storage devices in the world is this company. It's based in London and Cincinnati, and it's all consumer data. It's these you know it's your credit card data, it's your spending data. I mean, if they're scanning your pictures on Facebook, you know they're getting you know pretty good at, at getting uh, specific in terms of who. Who, who, who needs their products and how to reach them and what message works. If a billboard can read your face, it can tell that, you know, white guys in their 40s weren't interested in this billboard. But when we looked at, you know, um, women under under 20, they, they loved this cell phone ad. So there, there's this kind of, um, you know, building intelligence from the marketing world. Um, and one of the things marketers have, have asked me since the book is out is, isn't this all just the same stuff? Aren't we just seeing the same appeals and work we've seen since the 50s, which, you know, I, I think it's an insult to marketers for the past, they, they, they're not sitting still for the past 50 years, they're, they're getting good at what they do, and part of that is, is data, is capturing information, your spending habits, um, scanning photos, watching news, you walk out.